Welcome to my Etsy haul part two. If you haven't seen the first part, I will link it up there in the corner. But I have a few more things that I wanted to share with you guys that I bought on Etsy. And hopefully this video isn't gonna be as long as the other one. I only got stuff from two shops, but I did get like 10 items. So it may be as long as the other video. It just depends how long I talk. Cause again, you guys know I can talk. So let's jump on in and get to it. But the first store I bought stuff from came in this little bag. It actually came in multiple of these little bags. I just consolidated it all into this big pink bag. But let's open it up here. Bella's right in between my legs. She wants to see what I got too. Now this first seller had a lot of cute Disney earrings and it was really hard not to buy everything, but I resisted and just got four items. So the first up, are these Cogsworth earrings. Look how cute they are. They're actually a pretty good size. Like here's my nail for comparison. And I just thought they were just so incredibly cute. Sorry, I'm trying to make sure everything's in focus for you guys. Maybe if I take them out of the bag, it would be better for you guys because there won't be a glare. Let's try that for all of these. Yes, that definitely looks a lot better. He is just so adorable. He's made out of like clay or something. I love even the detail look inside of his clock. It's just so cute. I kind of want to put them on right now. But I already have earrings in and I have more earrings I need to unpack. So, okay, no, I won't wear these now, but I certainly will wear them very soon. Oh, Cogsworth, I love you. So far, I'm happy. Next pair of earrings. Again, I'm going to take them out of the packaging, so bear with me. It definitely helped on the first pair as far as eliminating some of that glare. And this is a little dangly pair. Hold on, I gotta get up close with the camera to see how the focus is. It's a little dangly Mickey and Minnie pair of earrings. Again, I just thought they are very different and certainly things I've never seen before and I can't wait to wear these too. We'll just go ahead and say that obviously every pair of earrings that I got, I can't wait to wear. I start to run out of descriptive words after doing so many of these unboxing. I'm just like, look how cute. Oh, they're adorable. I can't wait to wear that. I can't wait to use that. <laughs> I'm doing the best I can, guys. But the next pair of earrings I got, again, I'm gonna stand up so that I can make sure it adjusts well. Camera's having a moment today. These Mickey and Minnie pumpkin earrings. Oh my goodness, how amazing are these gonna be to wear at the Magic Kingdom at the holidays or just any of the parks. I keep saying Magic Kingdom, but I love all of the Disney parks. I love how the little mini pumpkin has a bow and I haven't been showing the backs of them, but they're pretty standard little backs. So yeah, I think they're made pretty well. And again, for my fingernail so you can see the comparison of the size. So these aren't like little dainty earrings like some of the ones I got on the first part of my Etsy haul, but I just thought they were so cute. And as you can see, I like dainty earrings and I like wild and crazy earrings. So I was excited when I found all of these. And the other pair that I got from this shop is another pair I can't wait to wear for Halloween. And it's Jack and Sally. Let me get in here, hold on. Here we go. Look at the detail on them. Sally, the only thing is, is that they flip over. Well, she's still sparkly on the backside. For a second there, Jack was flipped and I was like, what the heck, what happened to him? But no, he was just flipped around. So unlike the Haunted Mansion stretching room earrings that I got in the first haul that had designs on both sides, these are just on one side, but there's nothing wrong with that. I still think they're incredibly adorable. Even the little background here on the packaging is really cute. Can you guys see the attention to detail? And it seems like they're gonna be a nice length, so I'm excited. So did you guys like the first shop? I know I certainly did. Two pairs of earrings that are gonna be awesome for the holidays, some awesome Cogsworth. I don't have any Beauty and the Beast jewelry, and then just the cute little dangly Mickey and Minis. I'm happy so far. Now for the second shop, the packaging is just kind of normal. I, I would say it's boring, but I mean, they're just supposed to be sending me my items. I just got so spoiled by having cute packaging like the little pink bags and the last seller of my part one haul that had the very decorative Disney boxes with the little stickers on them. So again, I can't really say anything bad. It's just, it's not fun. But again, what we care about is what's inside the boxes, right? 
Now the first box has two little pairs of earrings. They're really small earrings, all of these. They're really dainty. They're really, really light, so they'll be easy to wear. They seem to be made pretty well. I'm not really sure of the material of these guys. Maybe you can leave me a comment down below as I show you and like take a guess on what they're made out of. I don't know if it's wood or whatever, but let me show you, right? And this is the first pair of earrings. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. I can't wait to wear these just on a normal day or when I go to Universal. Maybe I can wear these and I'll run into Beetlejuice. How amazing would that be? And the second pair of earrings in that box is also Beetlejuice related. They're little handbooks for the recently deceased. Now if you saw my part one, you guys know I got a necklace that has this on it. So now I have a little pair of earrings that match it. I can wear both my Beetlejuice earrings and my handbook for the recently deceased earrings, both at the same time. How exciting! So that was the first box. The second box I think has four pairs of earrings in it. These boxes are made really well. Really hard to get the tops off. Nope, there are three. We'll just stay with the creepy earrings and do this one and the other two are Christmas. I got some Jason earrings. So again, more earrings that I can wear for the Halloween season. Hopefully Halloween Horror Nights will happen this year and I'll have tons of creepy little earrings to wear. So I got Beetlejuice and Mickey Pumpkins and Jack Skellington earrings that I can wear for Halloween. But what about Christmas? Christmas is my favorite time of year, so of course I couldn't leave Christmas out. I had to get some Christmas earrings. Which leads me to my last two pairs. Look, it's Buddy the Elf. Buddy the Elf, what's your favorite color? I love these so much. Elf is definitely a favorite of mine that I have to watch every single Christmas. So what are some movies that you have to watch for the holidays? We've had Halloween earrings and we've had Christmas earrings. So just for fun, leave me a comment down below and let me know what your top movies are for both of those seasons. And we're at the very last bit of jewelry in this haul. It's coming to an end. It's Rudolph! She thinks I'm cute. That's what I always think about when I think of Rudolph. So do you guys like classic Rudolph? Do you watch all those old claymation classics come the holiday season? I certainly am a fan of Rudolph and I really like at SeaWorld when they have all the characters that you can meet and greet. So that's everything that I bought at Etsy. Leave me a comment down below. So you're leaving me two comments. One, you're telling me your favorite movie of each of the seasons for Halloween and for Christmas. And leave me a comment down below and let me know what your favorite piece of jewelry is that I bought. Again, I will put the Etsy vendors in the description if you are interested in seeing their shops and buying something I got or seeing the different things that they have to offer. But if you did enjoy the video, please remember to give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe if you haven't already and make sure to hit that bell notification so that you'll be notified every time I do an upload. But thank you so much for watching and until next time with another helping of a burger with everything.